Do you remember your January and February heating bills last winter? Most of them were up sharply, even though it was a mild winter. John Mettery shows us what we may have to pay this year in his Don't Waste Your Money report. The past few years, it seemed every week things went up in price. But have you noticed lately? Gasoline prices are down and something else may soon be dropping. Your winter heating bill in Pennsylvania. Chris and Jen Arnett, like so many homeowners last winter, were stunned by their January and February heating bills. In their case, $874 for one month. $350, $500, $600, 800 That has a lot of people worried about this year's bills, given that almost everything is up in price these days. The, the cost of uh, energy and everything going up and, you know, now you got to worry about your bills going up. Last year, so many couples had to bundle up inside their homes because their heating bills were getting so high. Luckily, that's changed this winter. So what we're seeing in a good way is a slight trending downward in pricing. Duke Energy's Sally Thalen says families who heat with natural gas should see some relief this winter. Natural gas prices have fallen by 30 percent since the end of 2022. Heating oil is down 20 percent. If you heat with electric, however, rates are up 5 percent since last year. One caution, if you is a third party energy supplier, watch out for sneaky rate hikes when your annual contract expires. They didn't realize that maybe the contract had ended and then things kind of changed. So if you have a third party energy company, watch for letters in the mail. Your rates could go up, even though most homeowners like the Arnett's. This is a disaster. Should see a little relief this winter. Now a big January freeze could send heating oil and natural gas prices back up, but it still probably shouldn't be as high as a year ago. And that way you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteries, ABC 27 News.